to make it uh, liquidized. And then you stir it and so all the ingredients dissolve. Yeah? Then you add a little um, purify water. And you let it stand there for a while. You add a little bit of um, flour as well to thicken it. You can use cornstarch or just wheat flour. Like one full tablespoon of wheat flour should be enough. And then uh, you cook this in a small saucepan. You can also use uh, butter to add on to it, or you just use plain like this. This is later when you, you eat your uh, food and you pull over your vegetable or your ham if it's not uh, savory enough for you. Some of the uh, vegetable broth seasoning is uh, kind of salty, okay? So you taste it. And if it's too salty, you add a little more water. Our ham is done. There's another alternative is that you keep the ham and everything in there and you prepare another a tray for your pudding. Let's put like two tablespoons of olive oil and line the, the tray beforehand with uh, some butter. Butter and olive oil together. And then we cook it separately. Yeah, keep it there first. And now, because the ham is cooked, you can also use the mixture of gravy that you just made. Wow, it's cooked nicely. And put it over the hot cooking ham, so all the gravy will be together in there, and it's also very nice. It's going to be cooked nicely, and we don't have to make separate gravy. You see, it's convenient like that also. Otherwise, you can boil the gravy that we just made and add it on later. For convenience, I just put the gravy mixture also in here and let it cook a little bit longer until it reboil again because we just put more gravy in there. After it reboil, we can take the whole tray out. And we prepare the the oil and the butter in another tray already. I'm telling you this so that in case you want to bake the Yorkshire pudding alone and you don't have to wait for anything, just put some oil into a tray, yeah, and some butter also. You smear all over the tray with butter and you put some more olive oil on it, and then you have to heat it. You put it in the oven and heat it until you can see the haze appearing. And then you can pour the butter in, in the tray and cook for 20 to 30 minutes. We put the prepared tray in the oven already, and we wait until it's heated. You can also hear it, you know, boiling inside. The sound of heated oil, so we take it out now. It's very hazy. Be very careful with all this oil and hot oven, eh? Always close it when you don't use it. I'm going to pour this butter onto this, and it's going to be fine. You have to be careful that the, the glove that you use real thick. If not, you use double. Before you pour anything out from hot oven, you try first if your glove is not too thin. The thicker the better. We put the tray back in there and wait for 20-30 minutes. 
Meanwhile, the ham is already there. Wonderfully cooked. Wow, the gravy is very thick and nice. Mmm. It is a little bit uh, fatty, you know, what we're doing. <laughs> but it's the holiday season, mm -hmm. and you eat it only once a while. And then uh, you wash it all down with uh, <laughs> juice or some different uh, non-alcoholic cocktail or non-alcoholic champagne, which we're going to have. So this is our veggie ham and tofu already roasted. And we have all this beautiful, nutritious boiled vegetable. And our Yorkshire pudding is done. There it is. When it's done, the bottom is very golden. And the top also golden a little. Yeah. It should be coming off the tray very easily because the bottom is very golden. I will show you. See how golden it is? You see golden under there? See that? Yes. Nice, huh? Yeah, that's, that is when it's done. Yeah, and we're going to put on the plate. Look at how golden all of them. See? That's yes. what it is. Good. Wow, Master. Wow, Master. Wow, uh, wow this yeah, is so lovely. <laughs> Christmas dinner, huh? Okay, bring your plate. Yeah. You see, uh, when the pudding is done, it's crispy like this. Okay, one pudding, yeah? Oh, yes, Master. One piece of pudding. There, that's it. Yorkshire pudding. Yeah, okay. And then, some ham here, one piece of ham. Wow. And some pineapple. Nice or not? Oh, yes, yeah. 